word prayer and then we'll have to play. And we'll just start with a meeting. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we just thank you for this day. Thank you for this time together, Lord, to conduct business for, for this county and this district, Father. Thank you for each and every one that's here, Father. We ask your blessings on this time, Lord, that you watch over, give us the direction, the wisdom, and every circumstance that comes up, Father. We thank you again for your love for us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Carol, please lead us in prayer. We place the flag, the kitchen, salute, the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, Indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Again, we want to welcome each and every one of you here to our uh, work set, our board meeting. Thank you, those that come in for the work session as well. Thank you for coming for that. As we get ready for this regular meeting. Let the record show the four members present are Randy Pepper, Smart Richards, Carol Hyatt, Bonnie Darwin, Robert Elliott, Superintendent Dr. Jason Barnett. So we have a quorum. We'll call the meeting in order. First item on our uh, agenda, we need to approve the agenda. You, board members, you've had a chance to look over your agenda. There's no changes to it. I'd entertain a motion to approve the agenda. Make the motion. Mark. Second. 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 Any questions on it? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed say? <coughs> motion to pass this unanimous. Uh, second item, we need to approve the October 17th minutes. Got a link there in yours. You had a chance to look over those. No corrections to the uh, October 17 minutes. I didn't make a motion to approve those. I'll make a motion. I second. Carol's got the second. Any questions on those? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed the same? Motion passes unanimous. Second item on counting, we've got the school financial statements, uh, general fund bank reconciliation, and we'll also take that on be there, bills and accounts those together so have a chance to look over those get those approved so we can pay our bills so i'd entertain a motion to approve that Make a motion. We'll give that to carol we'll give robert with a second robert has a second any questions on those all in favor say aye aye any opposed the same that shows unanimous in favor i don't think three we have some early graduates yeah well, we have several early graduates for your consideration tonight we have three uh for uh, consideration at Collins. We'll call you all with Amanda Hamilton and Brittany. All are any of those here? I didn't think any coffee. I saw any of those. Uh, Geraldine High School, uh, Addison Nicole Puckett, Judson Smith, William Smith Jr., Kirby Smith are, that's, I know that's y'all, right? So y'all have a seat. Y'all stand up, please. And, uh, any of you guys? Have anything you'd like to, to share to the board? <laughs> you don't have to. <laughs> we'll have you come up in just a minute, okay? Y'all can have a seat, thank you. Uh, from Plainy High School, we have Rebecca McGee. Is Rebecca here? I don't think so. And from Valleyhead, Daisy Hernandez and Brian, uh, Brad, Brian Rosales. Either, either of those here? Well, we really appreciate the Jordan folks getting here. Mr. Mayfield must have uh, sent out the reminder for you to come, so we're proud to have you here. And Mr. Mayfield was unable to attend, but he did send a message saying, uh, addressing the board, saying that with multiple joining high school requests for early graduation, uh, I apologize for my absence at tonight's board meeting. I had other obligations that prevented my attendance. While I have enclosed my recommendation within each student's application, I wanted to personally contact you and let you know that I sincerely believe, that I sincerely believe each of these students being reviewed are quality applicants for early graduation. Each applicant possesses unique qualities and maturity. Thank you for considering them, and for our students, I wish the very best of luck. So we appreciate Mr. Mayfield uh, for sending that in. We are proud of the work that you guys have done. Your commitment to your education has uh, has shown, and in your quali qualification for early graduation, we wish you nothing but the best of luck in your future endeavors. And if there's any way the Board of Education can ever support you and reach you those, please allow us uh, to do so. And I recommend with that uh, that we approve all these students. Uh, from Coswell, Carly Lockwood, Amanda Hamilton, uh, Brian, Brittany Oliver, Geraldine, Addison, Nicole Puckett, Judson Smith, William Smith Jr., Kirby Smith, and from Plainview, Rebecca McGee, and from Valley Head, Daisy Hernandez, and Brian Rosales, uh, we approve their uh, request for early graduation. All right, if you've heard the recommendation to approve these early graduates, I do make a motion to approve them. I make the motion. Mark, do I have a second? Second. Robert, any questions on these? 
All in favor say aye. Aye. Can you oppose the same? <clears throat> record show is unanimous in favor. Now, the next item is bids. These bids are our max bids. There could be some that could come in a little bit less than this, but these are the max amounts uh, possible. Uh, so this is the ceiling for these, but I would recommend we purchase two bids. It's a 2020 Chevrolet Silverado, $2,500 uh, with a work bid. Uh, at a price of $31,854.28 and a 2020 Chevrolet Silverado 1500 uh, at the price of $21,022.20. These are maintenance trucks. Thank you for this recommendation on these bids. I entertain a motion to approve these. I'll make a motion. Carol? I'll second. Any, any discussion on this? Any questions? Is this a state bid or? Well, state bid, you don't have to get any of the bids. I don't the Chevrolet did not get the state bid this oh, time. Okay. And so we have to put it out. Gotcha. We'll have to put it out. Donahoe did not get the state bid, so we have to put it out. We know it will not be more than this. Right? Gotcha. We have a firm quote. We could actually potentially be a little less than this, but it will not exceed this. Okay. Good deal. Good deal. We like less. We do. <laughs> they, got, they only got to bid on the Tahoe this time. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Gotcha. Any other discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any uh -huh. opposed the same? The record show is unanimous in favor. Aye. Right. Uh, the following on the job injuries, I uh, recommend we approve Connie Coots, CMP worker, Five High School for uh, zero days, Alex Durham, store worker at the Jack Kenny Technology Center, zero days. Uh, Rick, um, entertain a motion to approve these uh, on the job injuries. I'll make a motion. Um, we have a second. Second. Robert, any discussion on these? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed the same? Record shows unanimous in favor. Vote six. I recommend the following retirement resignation. Ms. Kathy Lingerfield, CMP worker at Plainview High School. That retirement is effective January 1, 2020. Uh, Ms. Carol Goodrich, store worker at Ivory High School. Resignation is effective December 31st, 2019. Brittany Graham, pre-K teacher at Crossland. Middle resignation effective December 20th, 2019. Heard uh, the recommendations of these retirements and resignations. I entertain a motion to approve these. I'll make a motion. Carol? Second. Mark? Any questions or discussion on this? All in favor say aye. 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 <coughs> the same. Record shows unanimous in favor. Recommend the following ladies of absence. Ms. Monty Thompson, speech pathologist at her high school. Uh, through this will be an extension from November 11, 2019 to December 20, 2019. Uh, Julie Abbott, CMP manager at Crossville Elementary, November 18th, 2019 through January 17th, 2020. Uh, Kenny Hanner, CMP worker at Jordan High School. Uh, this will be affected, uh, extended from November 4th, 2019 through uh, January 15th, 2020. Natalie Greason, elementary teacher at Five High School, uh, January the 2nd through April the 30th, 2020. Teresa Ward, elementary teacher at Crossville Elementary School. This will be extended from November the 1st, 2019 through December uh, the 19th, 2019. Uh, Kendra Varner, a pre auxiliary teacher at Red Hangman Junior High School. This will be a leave of absence from January the 6th, 2020 through April the 24th, 2020. Uh, Mr. Terry White, bus mechanic at the <coughs> bus garage. Uh, this will be extended uh, from 9 30 19 through December 19th through 2019. Uh, Ashley Williamson, secondary English language arts teacher at Sylvania High School, this will be from December 2nd through March the 13th, 2020. Kelby Ballinger, elementary teacher at Moon Lake School, uh, November the 7th, 2019 through December the 9th, 2019. Ms. Jessica Corsentino, pre K lead teacher at Collinsville High School. This is an extension from uh, no, November the 22nd, 2019 through January 1, 2020. Uh, Miss Jenny Faye Kildo, a Troy Month custodian at Crossville Middle School. Uh, this is going to be an extension from October 7th through December 23rd, 2019. Uh, Susan Lowell, pre-college at Geraldine High School, an extended extension from October 18th of 2019 through January 6th, 2020. A lot of reading. Yes. All right, you've heard the uh, Recommendation for these leads. Uh, entertain a motion to approve these. Make the motion. Mark, do have a second? Second. Rodney. Any questions or discussion on these? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed the same? Record show is unanimous in favor. 
Correct. Second, second and following placements. Um, can we get them? Yeah, we can get those. All right. Second and following placements. Jeannie Benefield, Technology Coordinator. Uh, Jason Lindsay, Instructional A at Revere Junior High School. That will be effective November the 4th, 2019. Uh, Misty Gilbert, Bus Driver at Ider High School, effective January 1, 2020. Larry Coffin, uh, Assistant Custodian at Crossville Elementary. Alicia Magdaniel, CMP worker at Crossville Elementary. And Anitra Brooke Fraser, CMP worker at Ider High School. <coughs> recommendation on these placements. I'd entertain a motion to approve these. Make a motion. Robert, do I have a second? I second. Carol, any questions or discussion on this? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed the same? Great show is unanimous in favor. Right. Adam Nine. Volunteer coaches at Collinville High School, Perry Hughes Baseball, Jeff Chumley <coughs> Baseball, David Hernandez Soccer. Uh, at Five High School, Mr. Andrew Hatch for indoor and outdoor track. Uh, at Geraldine High School, Thomas Wilby football. Uh, Kelly Armstrong softball. Cassie Black girls basketball. Jody Harper uh, football and baseball. And Carlos Benitez football and baseball. Right. First recommendation on the volunteer coaches. I'd entertain a motion to approve these. Make a motion. All right. Do I have a second? Second. Robert, any discussion on these? All in favor say aye. Uh, any opposed the same? Great show it's unanimous in favor. Right. Next item. Uh, I'm going to do A through K and then L separately. You don't want to speak yet. Okay. Uh, Kelly Ballinger, uh, I recommend we follow, approve the following contracts. Kelly Ballinger, homebound to IDA B. Uh, Brittany DeVos, sign language interpreting services, substitute for IDA B. Go play therapy, pediatric speech therapy, local. Uh, Tanya Bobo, 21st Century Crossville, Title IV, Haley Barber. Uh, 21st Century Crossville Teacher Title IV, Tracy Walker, 21st Century Crossville Teacher Title IV, Joanna Mays, ESL Newcomer Tutor Title III, Jim Presswood, Moon Lake After School Program, After School Program fees, Ken Jansen, uh, Central Office Landscaping Local, uh, Lori Willard, Blue Haven CMP Support uh, CMP, Rhonda Jolly, 21st Century Teacher Title IV. Right, you've heard the recommendation on these contracts to be approved, items A through K. I'd entertain a motion to approve these. Make a motion. Ronnie, do I have a second? Second. Carol, any questions or discussion on these? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed the same? <clears throat> Record shows unanimous in favor of these. Uh, item L, Jerry Gaddis is a, uh, a student, uh, early graduate. Uh, we, we've had some challenges filling some of our technician positions, and so uh, we, reviewed, <coughs> we reviewed applicants and we interviewed, and to be quite honest, when we went through those interviews, some of the, the applicants that we had just didn't really meet exactly what we were looking for. Uh, good folks, we just didn't exactly have some of the skills that we really needed. Uh, Mr. Gaddis had actually come up here and spent some time and just learning a little bit and helping the guys, and they said, hey, this guy's pretty, pretty sharp. And so we talked about what we could do, and, and the idea was, you know, let's, let's put this <coughs> man to work and help us. And he obviously can't work all day, every day. He's got some responsibilities and things and going to college and stuff like that. Uh, but we've approved him for early graduation, and, and, and we're going to put him to work and let him help us. And uh, hopefully, maybe we can do some more of this in the future because if we have some yeah, exactly. things that can help us. So I recommend that we approve the contract with Gary Gaddis. That's great. Yeah. Great. Good deal. All right. You've heard this recommendation. I have a motion to approve this. Make a motion. Mark? Second. Ronnie? Any discussion on this? And I think that's a really, yeah. really good on our part yeah. to, to do this. Yeah. Yes, it, it is. Any other discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed the same? <clears throat> Show is unanimous in favor of this. Real quickly, uh, do we have <coughs> Daisy Hernandez, uh, Brian Rosales, and do we have another early graduate? I thought we had a couple. Yeah, a couple in. come in. Uh, can, can, who, can you introduce yourselves? Amy on Gelson School. Okay, and? We, we went ahead earlier, I saw y'all come in. We introduced, we went ahead and approved y'all early graduation. The early graduates that were here, they went ahead and gave their speech earlier. <laughs> so, <laughs> we're, we're, we're about to go into executive session, so we're going to give you all the same opportunity before we're in the executive session. So would y'all like to do that now or after the executive session? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. But seriously, congratulations. I, I, I wish I, we, we did approve those earlier. 
but we do wish you well and we're proud of you and the work you've done. And I and the board would like a picture with each of you. So if you really seriously don't mind coming up here, let's get a picture together. All the other great. <laughs> I'm not organizing pictures. So we look all right. Okay. Jeez, mother. I'm already three. I'm three. Thank you. 